welcome to our July Little Ones. This time we're going to be thinking about the world, the world that God created and everything that's in it. And I'm going to start with a little prayer. So you can close your eyes and put your hands together and listen and say Amen at the end. God's peace to the mountains. God's peace to the plain. God's own paradise garden. Grow in the world again. Amen. Now, in the beginning, there was nothing. There was just nothing. Although there might have been just a big smile. And then, God decided to make something. And the first thing that he made was the light and the dark. And he called the light day and he called the dark night. And when God saw the light and the dark, he said, that's good. So the next day, he made something else. He made sky and the sea. And you see how the sea is shimmering in the light. And the sky gave us air to breathe and the sea gave us water to drink. And when God saw the air and the sea, God said, that's good. So now, the next day, God made the sun. He made the sun to shine in the day, sky in the daytime, and he made the stars and the moon to shine in the sky at night. When God saw the sun and the stars and the moon, he said, that's good. So then, he made the dry earth, and on the dry earth, he made all sorts of things grow. He made the green grass grow, he made the trees grow, he made the flowers grow, all the good green and growing things. God made them, and God said, that's good. So then next day, he made living things. He made things that live in the water, like fish and octopuses. And he made things that would fly. Oh, here's another one. Look, a shellfish. Once there was a fish inside there. And then he made things that flew in the air. Birds. All sorts of different birds. So many different sorts of birds, aren't there? And they sing and they fly. And the butterflies, their beautiful colours. And the bees and beetles and flies. All the things that fly in the air, God made those too. And he said they were good. So the next day, he made the things that crawled and run and walk on the earth he made tortoises got another one somewhere here it is a little tiny one I once found a little tiny one like that when I was in Morocco and I got a photograph of it sitting in my hand just like that there were elephants elephants in the jungle Lions, fierce lions, he made those too. And giraffes, he made giraffes. And dogs. And sheep. And all the other things. <laughs> <What's a> sheep? <laughs> all the 
other things that crawl and run and jump on the earth. And he even made ducks. It's a duck. Ducks are very good because ducks can swim in the water and dive down underneath and they can fly through the air and they can waddle on the ground. So ducks are everywhere. And when God had made all those things, one more thing is needed. I need to make something that will look after this beautiful world. And so God made people. He made you and me, all the men and the women and the children and the babies in the world. And he said, your job is to look after my beautiful world and make sure that it flourishes. That was really great, Mary. Well done. Thank you so much. We're going to get up on our feet now and do a song about creation, about God making everything. So I want you to join in with the actions. Everybody get up on their feet. Let's go. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. On day number one, God made light. He made the day. He saw what he made, it was his best award. Sing out those woes. Let me hear you sing, God made you. And now it's prayer time. I have three small prayers for you to listen to. When I finish them, you can help me say Amen. So you put your hands together, and close your eyes, and listen. Dear God, you have made so many things. How wisely you made them all. The earth is filled with your creatures. Amen. Second prayer. All praise to the maker of flowers. Pale flowers, bright flowers, bold flowers, 
shy flowers, long flowers, wide flowers, tame flowers, wild flowers. Amen. That's my favourite, the wild flower. Last prayer has come from the Bible, from the book called Psalms, which is a book of songs. And this is it. Shine through the night, O silvery moon. Shine through the day, O you sun. Shine in the dark, you glittering stars, to praise what your maker has done. Amen. And we finish by saying the little one's prayer. Jesus, friend of little children, be a friend to me. Take my hand and ever keep me close to thee. Amen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. On day number one, God made light. He made the day and he made the night. On day number two, God made the sky. It's big and blue and way up high. Ooh. You hear you say, whoa. Whoa. Day number three. On day number three, God made the sea. He made the land, every plant and tree. On day number four, Stars. He put the sun in the sky, super duper far. Whoa. Sing out those woes. Whoa. Sing God made you. God made you and God made me. He made everyone and everything we see. He made the earth and he made the heavens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. On day number five, God made birds and fish, dolphins and whales and things that go squish. On day number six, God made animals and bugs, foxes and cubs, all for us to hug. Whoa. You hear those wolves? Whoa. Sing day number six. On day number six, God also made man. He said it was good and part of his plan. On day to rest. He saw what he made. It was his best. Whoa. Sing out those woes. Whoa. I mean, he's saying God made you. Seven.